My art is all about movement and rhythm, which is why musicians are a central theme in so much of my work. I was asked by the Marshal of Warmia, Missouri in Poland to create a painting for the new concert hall being built in the ancient city of Olsztyn. It is a great honour to represent my country in the gallery of world art they are creating in the home of their Philharmonic Orchestra. Some paintings are easier than others. This one came easily. My vision for it was instant and retained its clear focus. In this case, the inspiration of historic Olsztyn and great musicians made it very easy. My first thought was the view through the eyes of a violinist and the world of Olsztyn growing out of the music and the instruments. There would be dramatic clouds that would grow from the bows of the violins and the audience would blend with the forest around the castle. The first drawings were on the computer, as always, but these were mostly very simple sketches, and the final drawing was worked out directly on the canvas. At first, I was just visualising the musicians. The most important thing at first was getting the feeling of movement and rhythm. I was creating visual music. I listened to the music of Novo Vieski and Chopin as I painted, as the most direct way to reach out to their hearts and souls. I started growing my hair like the conductor. He had long, flowing white hair, and while I could not be as white as him, I found the wild shock of hair helped me feel like I was in his shoes, channeling his spirit. He was orchestrating the painting as I was bringing him to life. He grew more powerful every day, and I let him have his head within the painting. It is always best for me when I surrender total control to the needs of the painting. As I give myself to the flow of paint from the brush, it then becomes a dance in which the painting gives to me as much as I give to the painting. I build the paint in layers and dabs, and put darks and either complementaries or harmonies into the underlayers, 
depending on what I want to strike through later on. I create textures as much as colours, and slowly the painting distills and emerges from the dreams that conceived it. It's turned out rather well. When a painting is finished, that's the best time. Because when I can see a painting come to life, as people find stories that are meaningful to them than the picture, that's what makes it all worthwhile.